Hey, what's up guys? This is my very first YouTube video. And as the title says, I want to talk about the BMW F30 3 Series steering rack issue. This is my 2012 328i and I have this issue. It's not something easy to pick up, but when you do, it bothers you a lot as it comes as a strange knocking sound from the front left of the car. As many first, I thought this has to do with the suspension. Apparently it's not. And I'm doing this video because I think I could have just found the right solution to solve this problem. Reading online, checking YouTube, you can find many suggested solutions, but I did not find this one. So I'm just gonna pull over now and get into more details. So first I'm gonna show you how to check if you have the same problem. The engine is not running, the car is off, and all you have to do is move the steering wheel. I will show you now. I'm not sure how well the microphone is gonna pick up the noise, but I can hear it clear. I hope it's gonna go through. So all you have to do is move the steering wheel like this. And now I will show you the engine bay. All right, this is gonna be tricky. I have a lot of car passing in the background. It's gonna be loud. And I'm trying to show you guys something in a super hot engine bay. Actually, I'm trying to show you the steering rack. And especially, I wanna show you this screw, what I will talk about in a bit. I'm trying to put the camera down. I will just keep it steady. And I will use some editing to show you the screw and I will talk about the suggestions you can find online related to this screw. Again, I'm not sure how well it's going to be, but I'm trying to do my best. And here is the solution I found. Apparently, there is an official repair kit for the F30 steering rack. Yes, you can get this from BMW, it has an official part number. I will put it in the description. You can order it. It's about $30 or 30 euros, something like that. And I will show you what's inside. Aside a few items in here, this is the main thing. This is the very same screw I showed you guys that's sitting on the steering rack or inside. And behind it, supposed to be this. Now the solution is, Take whatever is in there now and replace it with this. I'm not sure if it's the same exact part, it's just worn off or it's made of a different material, but that's it. Take the original one out, put this in, use this new or improved or maybe the same screw to put back on and that's it. You should be good to go. Now, when I got this from my local dealer, they told me when they replaced this, they will need to do a computer adjustment on the steering rack after it. So I needed to get an appointment two weeks from now that will make part two of this video where we're gonna find out whether this worked or not. Thank you for watching. I hope this is helpful.